Uh, Bass, a legendary pro wrestler, to find DOA 4 in order to stop his daughter, he announced his retirement and went to work on a Dotec offshore plant. Because that's a logical progression for your career, isn't it? He's going to settle down, live a quiet life, and let the youngsters take the spotlight, or at least that was the plan. But it didn't work out for him. For some reason. Like, why? Newly formed? You mean reformed? What the fuck was up that lip sync then? You and me are gonna do some sparring. Why are so many lines not have subtitles though? I mean, you know it's not like the most relevant, but it's still it's still should subtitle the lines. This matchup's already been done with these characters in this arena with these costumes. Yeah, mate. Damn it. The last thing, I don't know how Bass's moveset's been changed in this one. So even, even, though, I have, even though I did play as uh, Bass in like, for the Let's Play in uh, like to, in Ultimate 3 and 4, I don't know how his moveset's changed in this one. What the fuck? No, you die, you fucking douche. It's kind of funny how the two new characters, one's, one's uh, linked to Tina, one's linked to Bass. Honestly, one surprised me the whole thing with Bass here was, was simply because he added Mila and thought, okay, she's with Tina, a default tag partner. So Bass needs a new default tag partner. I think it's a default... Who was his default tag partner last time? I think it was... Was it Brad Wong? I think so. I, I, I don't recall. Or maybe it was Zack. But Zack's a twat anyway, so who cares? Yep. So I'm guessing this is on, on the uh, oil platform then. Who's working these spotlights? That's weird. How, how can he not figure it out? Yeah, this is my tournament, so I'm assuming that's that uh, that Zach's definitely still working with Eleanor, and uh, this whole tournament was his idea. But yeah, so uh, you may notice it says Mr. Strong. Yeah, he's, he's, go he's basically going undercover. But uh, yeah, so it's, it's like with, like with Lisa and La Mariposa, were different costumes, different outfits. Uh, costume different titles, names for the characters. Okay. But it is kind of weird if you think about it that Tina has a Southern American accent, Bass doesn't, yet Bass did raise her. Like, her, her, her mum is never met, is hardly ever mentioned, only mentioned DOA 4, so presumably she died when Tina was young. So you assume that Bass has raised her on his own. For, for most of her life. Why is it not just an announcer saying that? Is she the entrance music? <laughs> yeah, she just figures out immediately. Mr. Strong, it's so dumb. So you can, it's obviously where he gets the name from. Armstrong. I was wondering how long I could keep doing that before she would do something to counter it. Oh shit, no! No! Oh! But yeah. Uh, also, I, I looked into the, the whole thing with the music in this game. That I, I think... I think... <laughs> I think this mode makes it that the music is... Um, the lip sync's awful. But I think the music is... Um, in, the, in this mode, is like, just chosen for each match. And sometimes it's stage based, sometimes it's character based.
<laughs> yeah. She's still lost in the quarterfinals, though. Wrestlers going into politics, that's never a good sign. Oh, and Jesus, swerve! Of course, it's wrestling, there has to be a swerve. No, but it's, it's done so often that you know it's a swerve. You know it's going to happen, so the only way you can have a real swerve is to not have a swerve. That's how it works in the wrestling world. Because wrestling is over reliance on cheap gimmicks and, and plot twists. But it's good to see the, see the, the two uh, getting on together for once. I guess he's not trying to. Well, he wasn't necessarily trying to crush her dreams for once. He just, like, fought her. And then we go right back to. I don't want to say. It took us this long to finally get to. It took until Zach's chapter, so the prologue, chapter 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, then chapter 6 to finally get to the actual tournament, and then Rig carries on from there, Bass carries on from there, we actually get an actual round, and then it just goes back for Brad Wong. Master of a certain fight, so I can't be asked reading. I have to deal with four, he accompanies Elliot on his training, journey of training around the world. Uh... And then they find out about DOA 5, that's it. Yeah, so Brad Wong took a liking to Elliot, I guess, and started training him. China, yeah, that's that's all it is. Just... That's great, that he's, he's, he's on a journey around the world. And he's basically in the country where he started. I don't know, so I think he goes somewhere else. Like, why not go back to England? That'd be interesting. Be interesting to see him there. These two are so weird. I never understand these, these situations. Like, any civilized person wouldn't fight over it. They would just say, let's split it in two. <laughs> I feel like this scene should be a bit faster paced. So, where's Brad's other hand? He could easily grab it now. It's so stupid to see him. What's the point of it? You you ain't getting it, mate. That would actually be hilarious to have, to have give Elliot like a, a gruff Cockney voice. Sucker. Sucker. I got it. You ain't getting it, Brad. You fucking nonce. It's so funny just saying fucking nonce. Not fucking fucking. And the Brad Wong. Oh wait, shit! No. Oh no, that's it. I, was, I was thinking this might have been the, the, the hard fight. It's not. It's a fight. It's fight when you play during do Elliot's chapter. And uh, you. <laughs> yeah, I, lo I love. I do lo like like the stage. How everything's so destructible. Because it really like, like the kind of thing you might see in something like. I'm sure there must be like kung fu movies that do. I have I've places like this, like Wu Tang fighting movies and shit. No. Damn it. Fuck. Don't. No, no. Don't hurt me, Elliot. Haha. -ha. Looks like he hurt his back. It's like, well, I guess it would make sense. He got knocked out of a, no, not through a wall. But we're already outside. I'm guessing the monkey's gonna get it. You should think about entering. Yeah, the monkey's well gonna get it in it. This scene is so dumb. So who am I gonna have to fight is Brad Wong then? Other than Elliot. All right, the bit's done. It's so stupid. No way. I never win it. 
I'd never win it. I'm not good enough. I don't know why he thinks that. He's got a point, Mr. Elliot. The scene goes on way too long. We get the point already. Woof. You did. Called it. I mean, then again, it was it. It wasn't hard to figure out. Wait, were the monkeys like that in a? Uh, I don't, I don't care if it's not actually a monkey. It don't fucking matter. Good luck. <laughs> Guess I can do this. Again. But yeah, that uh, that that monkey uh, they were, weren't the ones just like that in the uh, in this in the stage where where Elliot fights both Brad Wong and Gen Fu in DOE Four. Imagine it was one of the same ones following them. Imagine this is imagine this is just not far from um from that place. You no, know, they should put they should put in like Genfu's like home or dojo or whatever as a as a stage. That'd be well good. I'm gonna die. Fuck no! No! Oh shit! Sorry, I didn't realize. I'm gonna have to like lower the volume of that because it's probably gonna destroy you if you listen to it. Let me try again, game. Good luck. This might be the tough fight I'm thinking of. I'm not sure. I'm, sure, I'm not sure Elliot even has a chapter. Yeah, he, he does. I, th I think. I remember. I remember there being a cutscene involving him later on. I don't. But I don't quite recall. A lot of the. I don't recall a lot of the details. Also, I think this was actually. Uh, that was a cool bit. But actually, I think this was actually Elliot's cost default costume in uh, Dead Alive Dimensions too. Is another case of them changing costume dimensions, but. Normally there's at least a costume the character had, had previously. Here it's just a completely random made up one. At least they kept it in for five, so you can you can always just argue that uh, it, that dimension's costume don't matter, he just has it here. Take that, you fiend! I win! Yeah, I that was only attempt three. It's done already. What a shit bastard. Oh. I hate Zack. He's such a shit character. So it's better than when he's voiced by Dennis Rodman. This, no, that is my island. I get a feeling the way to see at the fights is reuse the same voice clip both times. I'm not really sure why they need to show it again, just an alternate scene, but yeah. A few days later. Yeah, these these two are traveling around the world. I'm guessing Lei Fang will get the next chapter. Uh, but yeah, these these two are I just tra like just been traveling around the world together for some reason. I guess he really got on during DOAX. It's funny how they all just know each other. And a bus goes past. Don't forget the audio or not. Just because we're girls, don't you go easy on us. I wouldn't think of it. He well fancies her. And to be fair, you can't blame him. She is kind of fit, mate. You know. All oh, right, it's, it's, it's a tag match. But actually, a pretty good way of transitioning from one character to another when you think about it. If Elliot gets the next chapter, then this is a great transition. You get to play as Elliot briefly. How do you how do, how do you tag? I don't I don't I don't know. I don't recall. Fuck. There we go. Yeah, so th th there is an alternate version of this stage that's uh, where everything's active. I don't know why they bo even bother with like this version, but ah, uh, whatever, it don't matter. But of course, the question is, what the fuck is this? Because the game, the game makes it very clear that, that, that the the, the, uh, the DOA actual the tournament proper actually take oh, takes place entirely on the oil rig. Or oh, wherever that is. F 
fuck. No. Balls. Shh. Elliot, no, don't die on me, mate. Oh shit, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose. Damn it! Why do I have to get two of the not as good characters? Like Brad Wong's one of the fucking worst. Yes. Nothing to aim at, but if I'm, if I'm quick, yes, it's one down. Take this, take this, you bitch. I see the Showtime sign upside down, but it still seems to be active. Like, who plugged it in when it's not? Properly orientated. You dumb bastards. I had to get cheap to win. I'm sorry. I had no choice. The game made me do it. Let's get out of here. It was a pleasure fighting you. It would be fun if the two were just like slumped over on the floor. <laughs> but that scene was so pointless, mate. Elliot, yeah, it's just a good transition to be Elliot. Milk. So, looking at that picture, what do you think this story chapter is going to be about? Just just based on that. It's called Milk. It's a picture of Elliot and Christy. And Christy's wearing a pretty revealing outfit. I'll just leave you with that till next time. See ya.